Hi hey everybody, Robert here with more Rivet Training. Today we're looking at an Accor toolbar and we're going to discuss different family types uh, with regard to reference plane and face space. So here I'm going to go and this is a little problem when I got here. So I'm going to take this guy right here and pull it out. And there is our family. So now I want to adjust this and I want to place him Hmm. Somewhere. As you can see, can't really do too much with that guy. So I'm going to undo it. So that tells me this is wrong. So if you ever run into this problem, it's a quick fix and they're going to be all fixed. So I would select this family and then I'll edit it. So now I'm in this family now, and if I look at it under the project browse on the reference plane where we do all our work here. Okay, so this is reference plane base. So it should be working okay, but for some reason this is not working for us. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to go back into my 3D view, and I'm going to look here in my uh, family category parameters and select it. And so I can see right now a couple of things we're doing. Uh, you can change these categories wherever you want, but I want to make this generic because that's how all of them are. They'll show up in anything. It could be whatever you want. And then here, if I look, it says work plane based, always vertical. This should be changed to work plane based. So that was a mistake by somebody. And this doesn't have to be ticked. So I'm going to go OK. And then I'm going to load that back into the project. I'm going to go OK here. And I'm going to overwrite this parameter values. And then I want to pick it. And then I'm going to pick a new face here. So now it works. It'll, it'll move around. So, And then I could grab it again. I'll just copy it over here. And now I can take it and pick it, and I can pick it and put it on this face. So that's what's going on with that. Now I'm going to go and grab some more elements from, from more families from the toolbar here. Uh, let's go and grab, let's go one of these flat plates, I think. See there? Okay. Let's take this guy here. And I want to take him and place him right there. Okay, so he went right straight to his uh, location, even here. And that's because this is probably face based. So let's go and select, take this family and edit this type. Edit family. And this is also correctly done because if I go into my project browser, my reference level here, all's good. And then here, the person who built this family day, okay, it's, it's work plane based. So that's why. So if you haven't had that problem, just go and change the, whether it's work plane based. Now, I'm going to have a look at the face base now we use sometime. Um, so let's see if I can find one in here. Uh, let's do a little search here. I want to do something that I know has a face, a base face on it. So I want to go back here and see what else I can find here. Uh, I think most of these are okay. It's just the onesie that we had there, I think, but that's basically how you would change it. Um, let's look at this guy here. Pull him out. And he'll place it right there. And she's placed in there because, and that's how it wants to show, is the modeler now the person who did this. They had a good idea how this works, so we want to edit this family. 
and this is face based now in this case is this is a good way to do this because it's going to go and penetrate something and look at this in wireframe that's what you can see there so sometimes this works okay it just depends on the application and when we see something that we figure is going to work that we go ahead and make it that way otherwise you can still do this which is works fine and it's probably the way we're going to go with uh, so if I go and pick say where is that one at? So if I select this and I'll drop it in and it's sitting right right where we need it to sit. But in this case, if I edit this family, if I can get to it. Okay, one second. So this guy, if I select it and I edit this family, it'll probably be okay. That, see, this is a work plane base. It's working good because if we go into our project browser, let's look at our front view. As you can see here, this is created on the reference plane. And these will work this way as well. And as you can also see, the modeler has it work plane based. So, and these are all going to be next. So these are being worked on, fixed up in the process, coming soon with more neat stuff with coding parameters and stuff like that. So, hey guys, I'm going to leave it there. Just wanted to show you this quick video of how, oh my goodness, so we did that. Let me tab these views. Just click Z and you bring everything up. Then I want to tab this one here. I'm going to go to my view. I want to tab views from that view. Okay, so that's what happens, folks. Uh, these are the different types of families. And if you run into something kind of funny or strange, just uh, go and edit it. Uh, I think more experienced users would know that, but if you're not a more experienced user, that's how you do it. So I can just grab this guy now as before we saw it. I'm going to copy it. I'm going to place one right here. Oh, you have to pick a new, so I'm going to pick a new face, and this is the new face, and it goes there like that. So everybody, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Uh, everybody be safe, and take care. Bye.